Spokane City Council could revisit an investigation into former city administrator Johnny Perkins. Perkins resigned in July amid the city's misconduct investigation. Bronte Swarovski joins us live in studio with why council member Zach Sapone wants an independent investigation into the former city administrator. Well, Jordan Zapone says he wants to reopen this investigation to see if there was any potential oversight from the city's administration, allowing this misconduct to happen and to make sure nothing like it ever happens again. Is it a training problem? Is it a policy problem? These are some of the questions council member Zach Zapone wants answered following sexual harassment allegations against former city administrator Johnny Perkins. Perkins resigned in July during the city's investigation, ending it abruptly. The investigator found that Perkins directly violated city policy, using inappropriate language at work and creating a hostile work environment. But Zapone says he wants to know how any of this could have happened in the first place. I don't know who is uh, following through on this issue of a pretty serious matter of um, you know, sexual harassment policy violations in the city of Spokane and what are we doing to improve that, make sure it's better. On Monday, he could introduce a plan to launch an independent investigation into Perkins' behavior as city administrator. But the city says the investigation is over and the situation handled appropriately, adding that another investigation could have a negative effect on employees. Opening it up for another investigation forces those who have been through this already to be to relive the experience and that's not something that is helpful for anybody. It's certainly not helpful for those in the future who may have an incident that they need to be able to report. City administration is now looking to add more training about workplace misconduct. Currently employees only receive harassment training when hired. So there's probably a regular training schedule process that we can talk about. That doesn't require an investigation to do that. Council members could vote to reopen this investigation as soon as Monday. Live in studio, Bronte Sorotsky, 4 News Now.